Hello everyone, Sigler here. Bork, chef, you can call me whatever you'd like. Today it's uh, gonna be a very short video. Uh, it's just a little uh, thing that you should uh, like uh, not do. Uh, I, I've done this myself uh, like just previously. Uh, the thing is like if you are running the halls of origination, uh, the thing is um, I'm gonna show you in the, the clip here. Uh, let me just go to where the part is like there the few the first bosses. Let me show you like this actually. Uh, oh Crap, ah don't die Oof. So the thing is like in this uh, Dungeon the halls of origination you have the first boss and you have the earth path and the uh, the antreth uh, or whatever you call it and after that you have the uh, so after the, th the th uh, three first bosses you have four bosses that you're gonna take um, that is up the elevator. And the problem is, uh, if you're doing this in uh, the Olive, uh, well, looking for dungeon, the problem with it is that if you start, if you don't, if you don't, if you do this st mistake that I did, like if we look at this, um, let me just speed it up a bit there. So the problem that we did here. Is that we instantly, like, it was partly, well, not partly, it was actually my fault. Because I didn't think of this, uh, I, I didn't think that this was the last boss. Because I, I thought the uh, set uh, Seth or whatever, um, the this boss was the last boss, as you can see. So, we I just went up there and pulled. But the problem is, like, once you're done... You get the achievement and like the dungeon is cleared. And what ended up ended up happening was like I was I like when the boss almost was dead, I realized my mistake and was like it's gonna say that the dungeon is is uh, cleared. And I said to the uh, to the rest of the group like don't leave because I might miss uh, like I did a mistake. It's gonna say that we're done, but we have three bosses left. The problem, though, is that, as you can see in the video, right about here, yeah, the healer left. And the problem is, if you're at that point, the dungeon is done. So, it's not like you can start queuing and looking for a new healer to come in and finishing it. So, the problem for us was that, once it was done... It was done. Like the, it, uh, like you can't skip the th the three other bosses, which we accidentally did, and there's a lot of loot there that I want from the other bosses. So I was like, oh god damn it! But yeah, <laughs> it's a it's a mistake uh, from my part. But yeah, uh, it just is what it is. And currently, as we stand, I have item level. 326 and I have what was this one two three four five six seven bars left until max level So yeah, I've been chilling a bit. I've been working and My plan that I did was Just get like friendly with everything Well, I gotta do the wild hammer wild hammer clan and get the tabards and after that I'm just gonna run dungeons pretty much That like that's it so yeah, um, just a small tip, like don't do that mistake. Don't start with pulling the Raj, the uh, construct, construct of Sun, because it's gonna say that the dungeon is clear and you're gonna get the Ashima for the Halls of Origination as well. So if you're a tank and you're leading the group, don't do this mistake. Unless it's like, ask if the others need the other bosses. It, like if you don't need them, ask them like, do you really need this uh, anything from the other bosses? Because sometimes it could be nice to just skip and be done with it. Because Halls of Origination is the, in my opinion, one of the longest dungeons in the history of World of Warcraft, and it's kind of boring. But yeah, that's a small tip. I uh, click this video, and I'll see you over there. Before you leave, make sure to hit the subscribe button. Uh, <laughs> 
can't even talk. Make sure to hit the subscribe button and liking this video if it have, if you felt like it helped you. If it didn't, I hope that you already knew about this. And if you did, that's awesome. But click this video and I'll see you over there. Bork bork.